What's up guys, how y'all doing today? Got the PVAMU shirt on the PV, you know, you know what I'm saying? Repping my school, about to wrap up my freshman year. I don't know if some of y'all knew, but I'm a freshman in college, you know, wrapping up my first year. I will officially not be a freshman as of Monday. Like, I don't care what school says, I take my last final Monday. And so therefore, I will consider myself a sophomore after I take my last final Monday, but I don't actually leave campus to Thursday. You're wondering, why am I telling you this? Why am I telling you that I will have two free days to do nothing but pack up and clean? Because on one of those days, I plan on sitting down and doing a channel update, which you will probably see when I'm home on Friday. So is this a double upload week we're looking at? I think it is. Just wanted to let y'all know what was going on in my life. I just came to sit down as I wrap up my first year of college to give y'all a little bit of advice. Um, I don't really have everything planned out that I'm going to say, so I'm just going to start talking. And hopefully this video isn't forever. Alright, um, academically, go to class. Just like go to class because like it's one of the simplest things to do and it helps you so much. Like if you're in class all the time and teachers recognize you're in class and you always sign that role, they won't let you fail. Like they'll help you out because like you come to class shows you care but like well all i'm saying is like go to class it's easy and it helps you raise out and you know most importantly you're paying for them that's your money if you don't go to class you're taking money out of your own pocket um second thing on the academic um front find time to do your work if that's after class if that's in the library if that's what you and your homies choose to do do that but like find time to do your work that's really what i try to do like first semester i was big on it i would leave class and just go straight and do my work second semester i wasn't able to hold it up as well but like i would um go to the library with my friends and with my um girl you know what i'm saying bro so like Sometimes you gotta do that. Like, if you still wanna hang out with your friends, you still wanna be around people, it's like, hey, let's all go to the library and do work. Cause, like, if there's nothing really going on on campus that night, y'all can really go to the library or, like, go somewhere, go to a building, go anywhere, and get work done. So, when stuff is going on, y'all ain't got work to worry about. You know what I'm saying? So, like, find time to do your work, just like, do your work. You know, you don't let it pile up because, like, work in college can really pile up and it can stress you out and break you down. So like stay on top of your work. Third thing for academic wise, this isn't something I did, it's something I witnessed happen. Um, make sure your teachers know you like go to office hours and stuff because like that can really bump up your grade. Like I said, this isn't something I really did, but this is something that um, people around me did. And I saw like how they were like guaranteed good grades or the teachers were, like, I got you because they always came to them. So like, it's good to come to teachers. Like, like I know how you feel if you're like, I don't want to go talk to the teacher or whatever because I'm that person, but like, Next semester, I don't think I'm gonna be that person because like I watched it help people out. And I was like, maybe I should go talk to my teachers. That's all I got for academic wise. Like do your work, go to class, talk to your teachers, get good grades, do all the other fun stuff, but you know, yeah. Um, as far as like socially, don't be in your room all the time. You know what I'm saying? Like when I first got here, yes, I was scared. I was nervous when my mom pulled it off, I like, I almost cried. I was like, wow, I'm really here by myself. But like something in me was like, just don't sit in this room because like you're not going to make friends and sit in your room. But like you got to leave the comfort of your room and just like be outside. Like even if you don't necessarily have anything to do, like I would just sit in the TV room and like people would come by and like talk to me or I sit outside. Like if people were gathered, I was gathered near them find stuff to do, making friends and stuff. Cause like eventually people start asking, hey, you wanna come eat with us? You wanna do this with me? You wanna do this, that, and that. And look, boom, you got friends now. So like make friends, <laughs> make friends. Just don't have your first year experience be you in your room by yourself with Netflix or whatever. Don't do that. Mm -mm. Um, Second thing, um, roommate, be a good roommate. You know what I'm saying? Like be a good roommate. Like be somebody that you would want to live with like and be respectful like don't take forever in the bathroom leave the bathroom as clean as possible like just be a, aware that somebody else is living with you because i promise you if you do anything wrong with it anything that bothers that person they're going to tell somebody else and then people are going to be looking at you different because like oh he be spending like six hours in the bathroom or oh he keep the room dirty and like that's just something you don't want attached to your name you know what i'm saying man so be a good roommate be nice to your roommate like i don't necessarily um 
talk to my roommate on a daily basis like i don't go over there and just have conversations with him but like i'm nice to him i speak with him like we have some sort of communication so like just i i feel like you should just be nice and just be able to talk to your roommate you know you don't want a hostile environment because like it could be hostile enough out there but like i feel like when you come in your room and you about to go sleep you don't want no hostility you don't want no Unpeace, no unrest. You just want it to be cool, chill environment. You know what I'm saying, man. So just that's just me personally. I don't know how y'all feel. Like if there's something you can't stand that your roommate does, like bring it up to them definitely. Cause like I would hate for you to live there for a year and just like hate something that they do. Cause like that's just not gonna be a peaceful, positive environment for you. You're just gonna be upset every time you go in your room. Be a good roommate, make friends. Um. Another thing with the friends thing, you might outgrow some of your friends or some of your friends might grow in the opposite direction of you and that's completely okay. Like, you might not have the same relationship with them anymore because of situations, because of stress, because of college stuff. But like, that's okay because like, it's natural. You know, people are only in your life for seasons and if their season is up, their season is up. You know what I'm saying? If, like, if it's in God's will for them to be your friend, they're going to be your friend. And if it's not in his will, okay. He, let him go um that goes the same for high school friends like i know you leave high school thinking oh yeah i'm gonna have all my high school friends and we all gonna be cool and we're gonna go back and see each other it's like it might not be like that but like as long as you're still cool because like i'm still cool with people i went to high school with like i still have a relationship with them but like it's not how i thought it would be when we were graduating i thought i would like come back on breaks and see them but it's like no that doesn't necessarily happen but i'm still cool with them we still talk over text and stuff so it's like that just in general you might just outgrow friends or like the wife might put you in a position where it's like we don't hang out like we used to or like we don't do the things that we necessarily used to do or we don't talk as much but like that's just life um about relationship wise i don't think you should necessarily go looking for a relationship because like in college there's a lot of people who aren't really looking for relationships they're just looking for you know just people to like be involved with and stuff so watch out for that um i necessarily didn't go looking for a relationship i'm in now but like if you end up in a relationship that's cool too like I know some people are like, oh, I don't want to be caught in a relationship and commitment. And I, like, bro, if you end up in a relationship, give it a chance. Don't just, like, set it down because you end up in one. Um, I didn't necessarily expect to end up in a relationship, but I am in one now, and I'm extremely happy in it. So it's like, just don't run from relationships unless you really just don't want to be in a relationship, in which case, let that be known. Um... Another just general thing, mind your business. Like, just don't put other people's business out there because that can really, really, really mess up friendships, mess up groups, mess up things. Like, just, like, keep stuff to yourself. Like, if somebody tells you something in confidence, they tell you in confidence. Or, like, if somebody tells you something that sounds kind of like a secret, assume it's a secret and don't tell anybody else. Just, like, mind your business. It will make your life easier and the people around you will make their life easier. So, you know, kind of just, like, Mind your business sometimes, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's mind your business, it's mind your business, you know what I'm saying, man? But um, that's kind of it I have for college. Um, your first year will be a crazy experience. It will be a roller coaster ride. You will have a lot of fun times, a lot of great memories, and then you will have some low times, some really stressful times, because college is stressful. Um, But it will be a lot of fun, and then you'll look back and be like, I love college, and I love this year, and yeah. And if you don't, transfer maybe i don't know i'm really happy with the choice i made with the university i'm at and like where i am in life right now like i'm happy and yeah that's kind of it i'm kind of rambling now i hope this advice video was helpful for y'all um like i said channel update video coming before i leave probably you won't see it till after i leave but you know i gotta update y'all for what's happening in the summer you know um because sometimes 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 summertime summertime decks but anyway man i hope y'all enjoyed this video i hope it was helpful for y'all go ahead hit that like button share this video comment on the video hey man go ahead and subscribe if you haven't subscribed because you know we're going up we doing exciting things but hey man y'all think i see the hub of all those decks here it's out